Lila, what, the reason that I want to show this picture is not just to show the humanity of this darling little girl, which obviously uh, is very evident, but also because the reason that this baby was born so early was because the mother had a health problem. And the mother had a health problem that required an abortion? Nope. An emergency C-section. And this baby survived. Yet, Lila, 31 states allow this baby to be killed at this state of pregnancy. Yes. Yeah. It, exactly. And that is exactly the schizophrenia that has plagued our country where in one moment it's a baby and we're celebrating. There's headlines, international headlines celebrating this little baby from San Diego, the smallest baby to survive. And then the other hand, you have celebrities and Disney and Netflix and every single Democratic candidate demanding for the right to kill a baby that exact same age. This is wrong. It is insanity. It needs to stop. And look, abortion is not a medical treatment. Full stop. Medical professionals, over a thousand of them in the Dublin Declaration, have come together, APLOG, America's pro-life version of the ACOG, which is now pro-abortion. It's a obstetricians and gynecologists who are pro-abortion, but the pro-life ones are saying, look, we can love them both. If you need to deliver early or do an early C-section, you don't have to kill that baby first. Give that baby a shot at life. And that's what they did in San Diego. And look what's happening. We're all celebrating it. International head headlines are lauding it as the power of medical advancements to save lives. Let's focus on loving them both and saving lives and do away with this insane, illogical position that it's a baby right now when it's born, but moments before it, birth it passes through the birth canal, it's not a baby. It can be discarded like so much trash.